guys and welcome to my channel today i am here sharing my 10 cards one kit video using the new and exclusive love from lizzie january 2024 card kit the theme of the kit is sending sunshine and it's fully packed with craft gems now i love my florals and given the fact that mother's day is just around the corner at least for me where i live it's on the 8th of march so i need a bunch of mother's day cards Actually, the 8th of March is the International Women's Day as well. And yeah, but you guys, have you seen the lovely donkeys? So, mine have names. I love them. Now, let's see. As per usual, you'll find links provided in the description box, as well as all the information on how to become a Love From Lizzie subscriber. Now, for my first card, I am using the Sunflower from the stamp set, and I've also made a mask so I could stamp it multiple times. To color the three flowers, I am using lemon yellow and emerald green VersaCraft ink, as well as seated straw, tea dye and walnut stain distress inks. And I am using the layering stencils provided in the kit. To embellish this card, I am using the gems and some twine.
for my second card, I'd like you to meet Matilda. She is one of the lovely donkeys and this card is showcasing her. To embellish this card, I am using the gems and for the sentiment, I am using a long form stamp set to write Happy Mother's Day. I love sunflowers. They are not my favorite flower because tulips are, but I love them. And this pattern paper is actually my second favorite out of this set. So I had to showcase it somehow. To embellish this card, I am using the pillows that came in the kit and I think this is a new color, yellow with gold finish and some of the gems from the kit.
And here is Aurora. Yes, from the Sleeping Beauty. Look how precious she is. Now, this is one of my favorite cards out of this set. I have four, I think. To embellish this card, I am using some green gold finish pickoffs and two gold hearts. I just love this card. I love the little precious donkey and I think Lizzie does too, as she is the one on the cover. My fifth card is featuring another donkey and he is lucky as his four lift clovers suggest. For this card I am using my favorite pattern paper and as you can see I am trying my best to cover as few as possible. To embellish this card I am using some gems and the pillows that came in the kit. For my sentiment I used you fill my day with sunshine. As I previously told you, I am in need of Mother's Day cards, so this card is made for that occasion. And, of course, I had to make two.
For card 7, I am using again one of the donkeys, and this is Renee. Look at these big blue eyes, I love her. Now, for the background, I am using one of my favorite pattern papers. It has these lovely donkeys. Now, I was not sure how to use the stickers, but seeing Renee, I had to make her stand on a haystack. For the sentiment, I am using Hey There, and this is from the add-on stamp set. is a green symphony. I've used some green pearlescent cardstock and the green dotted pattern paper. To embellish this card, I am using some honey gold glitter nouveau drops. Here it is, my all-time favorite card. This card is featuring August and October, two of the donkey ephemeras from the kit. For the sentiment, I've used an older stamp set and stamped a plain and simple hello. But after seeing the card, the black ink 
seemed too harsh, so I've used the gold gel pen to write over it. Card 10 is a shaker card. In the kit we received two golden picture frames. Now I wanted a white one and had two leftovers from a previous kit and I used one to make a shaker card. For the shaker beads I am using the gold glitter from the kit and some nail gold beads. For the sentiment I am using sending sunshine and I've pre die cut sunshine and I'm going to stamp sending.
Thank you so much for staying with me for a longer period of time. Like and subscribe for more videos like this one. Until next time, bye guys!